I'm a hopeless romantic because I can't let myself believe that each one of us is an island waiting out at sea for an ice age to come along and drop its second glances on our cute little tropical heads. It's a fine line between calamity and irregular heart palpitations, but love and insanity, those are the exact same fucking thing. As for sorrow, that's fleeting. Like morning fog burnt off, like the constellations and teenage complexions, like childhood memories collecting dust. It's scary that we can reach a state of lucid death without feeling the reaper's breath combing our necks. Death is waiting for us in the parking lot, all of us. Not for what you think, but just to give us a stern wake-up call, like, WAKE UP! And when you finally do, the first thought you have should be thank you, because life, life is wasted on those people. The trash hearts, the deadlights, the sphinx heads that can only think that just because they have a pulse, they're living. On average, we age at a rate of 1.25% each year. In a best case scenario, we have about 29,000 days for singing at the top of our lungs in our cars like no one is watching us, or 700,800 hours for Eskimo kisses, or 42,048,000 minutes for having a conversation with our eyes and not our mouths. That's roughly 2,522,880,000 moments that we will never get back. That's another. That's another. That's another. We're not in love with life like we should be. Even though she writes this every day, I hope you are doing well. I miss you. Forever yours, XOXO, stamped return to sender. And when it does, she weeps. We call this rain when she weeps. When it rains, we run from it, scared to get our toes wet. I'm going to take some guts to kill yourself, but to live, to actually live, that takes some fucking balls. So write your name in the sand so big that even God couldn't deny you exist. Reenact the greatest love story ever written with someone and find out that you weren't really acting. Write your last will with crushed up cinnamon and then set it to fire so the only time you spent thinking of your own death is how sweet it smelled when it was fucking burning. Sleep in the nude with someone else. Make it a mountain if your life is a molehill. I'm a hopeless romantic because I believe in the old cliche. You either get busy living or you get busy dying. And I'm not planning my funeral anytime soon. Preach! <laughs>